Derry Girls star Siobhan McSweeney has detailed the toll of fire that gutted her home has taken on her, speaking in a new interview. Siobhan McSweeney's London flat was destroyed by a fire while the TV star was enjoying a night at the theatre. The Irish actress, who portrays the role of Sister Michael in Channel 4 show Derry Girls, is now back in her own home but can't stop worrying that there will be another blaze. Following the incident which occurred back in 2019, Siobhan had to stay with friends and family while her property was made habitable again. Days after the first lockdown lifted, the 41-year-old moved back in after spending months on various sofas or in spare rooms. Although relieved to be safe, the Channel 4 star has had many sleepless nights since the fire. She now worries about being caught up in one again, in addition to contracting COVID, amid the coronavirus pandemic. Siobhan, who also hosts the Great Pottery Throwdown, said it had been an intense time. I couldn't sleep at night. I kept thinking, there's going to be a fire, I need to keep the door open so that the fire brigade can come in and save me. On the other hand, I thought, I need to close the door, it, the pandemic, will kill me. It was a really intense time, she told this week's Radio Times magazine. Earlier this year, the actress revealed that she had been left in an anxious state following a rubbish period of her life, during an appearance on Ireland AM. She spoke about the fire in more detail and said it had followed two very difficult years. I've had a rubbish couple of years actually. In 2018, my father died, nine months later Betsy of the Champagne Trifle died, and then two months after that my house went on fire. She went on to reveal that it was an electrical fire. One of those cubed adapters fell out of its socket, like by a millimeter and it caused an electrical fire. I lost everything. By the time lockdown started I was technically homeless, she explained. Later this week, Siobhan will star in a new travel series. She will explore Northern Ireland after falling in love with the area while filming Derry Girls there. The four-part series will see her explore the lakes, mountains and coastlines. If the last year has taught me anything it's that life's too short to sit indoors. As a keen walker, I'll be lacing up my walking boots to spend some much-needed time hiking, kayaking and wild camping in this wonderful corner of the world, she said of the show.